So welcome back to part two of the question that I get asked, which is why does my collagen get depleted? My name is Balsam and I talk about all things skin and injectables. So uh, in previous part, which is part one, I covered three reasons why collagen gets depleted and this is the natural aging process, UV radiation, as well as inflammation. And in this part, I will cover three more reasons why collagen gets depleted. So one of the factors could be glycine deficiency. Now glycine is one of the major structural components of collagen production, making up approximately 30% of the amino acids happen, which, happens to be, um, which happens to be glycine. Now every third to fourth amino acid sequence found in collagen happens to be glycine, so it could be a possibility that glycine deficiency is the reason why we have collagen depletion. Now another factor that can affect collagen depletion is menopause. Uh, during our perimenopausal and menopausal stages of our life, we lose um, estrogen and estrogen supports collagen production. And in fact, it does that by increasing the collagen content and also increases collagen thickness. So did you know that 30% of collagen is lost in the first five years of menopause? Now the third one is gene mutation. Now that could be a, a mutation in the collagen 1 gene or it could be a mutation in the enzymes that break down collagen. And generally speaking, these enzymes are present and they have a value uh, according to the homeostasis, homeostasis of the cell function. But overexpression or mutation of these genes can actually cause excessive breakdown of collagen and therefore collagen depletion. So did you know that um, UV exposure, such as sunlight exposure, can increase uh, the expression of these enzymes, which in turn results in the breakdown of collagen, hence we get more collagen depleted. So as you can see that there are factors that are with, with our control, within our control to actually um, try to halt or reduce the depletion of collagen and there are factors that we are that simply out of our control. However, we can do everything ourselves to delay the signs of aging by A, ensuring that we are protecting ourselves from the UV radiation and the, suns, the sun rays by wearing sunscreens and avoid overexposure. B, we can try to adopt a healthier lifestyle and also exercise mindfulness and wellness and that way we can try to prevent um, prevent inflammation as inflammation is a, a major factor of uh, collagen depletion. So really guys, it's all about achieving a balance as we age. We can't stop aging, but we can reduce the signs of aging. Now, if you want to know more about collagen production or collagen depletion, how we can actually work to, to ensure that the right skincare is also for us, please get in touch on info.com and follow for more. Take care.